these people. What did we just see? And how about Brown with the stare down on MB? Do you think that you have exceeded expectations? I didn't care about what the expectations was, to be honest. I got I got booze when I was drafted, so I probably did exceed some expectations, but you know what I mean? I just let the chips fall where they may, and here we are now. So to you, what is your ceiling? How high is your ceiling? I don't have a ceiling. I'm going to just keep my head down and keep working and see where it leads me. So 28-year-old Jay, how many championships 28-year-old Jay like that? I'm not going to jinx myself, but I sat <laughs> in six years. I'm going to go ahead and say five or six. I'm going to say that. So you win in the championship every year from here I don't want to, yeah, I don't want to jinx myself. You already did. You already said it. And I don't play to lose, so I'm going to go ahead and say I'm gonna go. I'm gonna give it a five. You know what I mean. Five rings by 28. That's what. I'm gonna go with that. Yeah. How confident are you about winning this year? Super confident. <laughs> like people misconstrue confidence and arrogance. For sure. You know what I mean. I'm not being arrogant, and we gonna have to take the steps to be the team that we say we want to be, right? It's because we got the mindset of a champion. I think that's where it starts. So when your basketball career is over, when you're no longer 22, I have no idea. What do you want to be remembered as? What um, type of player? I'll say one thing: if I'm remembered as just a good basketball player, I feel I will feel like I didn't do my job. Now I know one of your nicknames is Old Man. How you know that? Because I know that. Am I right? Yes or no? <laughs> uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. One of your nicknames is Old Man. Right. And it's because you know people seem to think that you have this wisdom that's just beyond your years. So we're going to put that to the test. Really? Yeah. Now, Dalen is a cryptic tweeter. He kind of sends out quotes and inspirational messages. So I'm going to read some of those to you. You're going to tell me what they mean, how you interpret them, how they've applied to your life. Okay. Are you ready? <laughs> Don't get me in trouble here. Tweet, a patient man eats ripe fruit. Patience last year was one of the things that I struggled with because I want everything now. So that was one of the quotes that reminded me to to be patient. That's okay. the deep meaning. The I deep am. meaning of that. The moon might steal light from the sun, but they never get the two confused. <laughs> Please explain. <laughs> so uh, imitation is the highest form of flattery, right? So the, the moon steals light from the sun, but they never get the two confused. So you just repeated? <laughs> he basically yeah, repeated yeah, yeah. what the tweet was in his explanation. I'm going to break it down ATL style. Okay, break three. it down. Break you, it can, you can bite my swag all you want, but you mean, but I'm still me. I'm still the sun.